Uh, let's get our next guest out, ladies and gentlemen. He's one of, I think, the most talented young actors in Hollywood, and he seems like a lovely fella. Here he is, Mr. Matthew Lillard. I brought a beer. Is that okay? Are you, now, you're drinking already this evening? I, I'm, well, I'm hammered. I've been back there for a well, long time. I think, <laughs> I, I think Ricky Tomlinson's a bad influence on you. No. Ricky, I think, is drinking water. No, he's not. He's a, bit, he's a pale ale man, I think, or bitter. Mild. You're mild this evening. Did, it, did you bring it with you, or did we provide that? Both. Yeah, because you... <laughs> be on the bloody safe side. It, yeah. <laughs> I've seen Ricky turning up at big girl wool ceremony sometimes with a carrier bag from like Safeways full of cans of miles. Safe, please, if you don't mind. Don't lower the tone of the show. <laughs> there you go, he's a class no, act. I have no idea what he just said. <laughs> I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. Well, you, you know, you work with Scooby Doo and you can't understand Ricky Thomas. <laughs> I, I think you've just insulted one of our premier. I'm sorry. Actors. Ricky, I'm sorry. You should apologise. Ricky and I are going to scrap after the show. Uh, Ricky, I'm sorry. Uh, I've seen you in both the Scooby Doo movies. I've seen you in loads of films, but uh, I really like the Scooby Doo movies. My you do? Yeah, I really like them. You're a family man. That's why. Do you not like them? Uh, I like. I like any movie that has more than three farts in it. <laughs> well, there's quite and a lot. By the way, I'm in it, so I have to like Yeah, well, it, you right? have to like your own work. Uh, what's it like working on a movie like that? Because uh, Scooby-Doo, that's not a real dog in the film, of course. That's a kind of... Uh, yeah, it's uh, not real. Thank probably. goodness for that. Yeah. Um, <laughs> and so you've got this... Uh, you're working to an animated character that we see at the end result. What are you acting to when you're making the film? Um, it's a funny thing, actually. There's a, a guy... We shot the first movie in Australia um, at the, in the Gold Coast, right. and there was a guy named Chris Kershanks who was... I don't know how you say it here, but uh, uh, a little man, a midget, if you will. Okay, well, we've used both those words. Okay, good. <laughs> well, it's you know, PC terms, it's it not PC terms. I know you've had a beer, but essentially our language is... I've had a lot of beers. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, but our language is essentially the same, okay? <laughs> you don't have to worry too much. No, but, but there's a PC, you can call... It, well, is it well, okay to say midget? Well, it's it, not okay, that's wrong. Well, isn't midget a technical term for a certain kind of growth disorder? Yeah, a growth disorder. We had a man named Chris Kershanks with a growth disorder. Okay. <laughs> That's exactly what I was looking for. Feel free to call me anytime you're in trouble. <laughs> uh, so you had a little fella one So we had a little guy who, um, <laughs> it's terrible. He was very yoked. He was buff, actually. He was a kind of pumped up uh, yeah. person of restricted little. growth. Exactly. Anyway, so he's running so anyways, out, pumped so up. So we, we would do these big crowd scenes, yeah. and you'd have hundreds of extras, and you would, Chris would put on this Scooby-Doo outfit, this dog suit. He had a suit. He had a very nice suit. Now, hang on. Was that his suit before the film? Did he already have the suit, or they gave him the suit to make the film? No, they made him the suit. Well, he might have been an enthusiast. <laughs> or a party trick? What are you saying? <laughs> well, maybe he had the suit. That's all I'm saying. I've got a Spider-Man suit. They didn't ask me to play Spider-Man. <laughs> Too much. You'd like to see a photo. I've seen your wife, by the way. Have you? She's cute. <laughs> I saw her at the BAFTAs. Okay, she okay. looks fiery. Yeah. You sure you've had plenty of drink? <laughs> uh, you know. Sorry. I was back there. Is That's it? the big difference. When you do an American talk show. Yeah. First, I'm a little scared right now. Why is that? Because you say your name and people are like, oh my God, Jonathan Ross. They get scared for me. Most of those complaints weren't proven. I mean, really. <laughs> uh, you brush against one young woman in a crowded bar. <laughs> When you say your name and people are like, Jonathan Ross, woo! Well, that's really kind of you to say that. No, I'm not saying that. That's real. Oh, you're not saying that. <laughs> oh, I have no idea who you are. Well, thank you. <laughs> well, that's... I don't... Yeah. I don't... I don't... Uh, <laughs> and you know what, Matthew? I had the feeling tomorrow morning when you wake up, you won't remember any of this. <laughs> now, wait a second. <laughs> so, there are uh, kids <laughs> watching. Shaggy's hammered. <laughs> Uh, let's have a look right. at let's have a look at a bit of Scooby Doo before okay. we move on. Sure. This is Matthew, and this is from Scooby Doo Two, which I think was. I've the, seen it. You of know. course, you've seen it. So have I. <laughs> uh, 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 well, uh, well, let's just remind ourselves if that's okay, because we have a clip. Matthew in Scooby Doo Two. That's a terrible clip. Why is that a bad clip? I'm barely in the clip. Well, you think you're in it? That's the dog and a bunch of skeletons. Well, the film's called Scooby Doo. <laughs> And you want to see the ghost. That's why I like number two. There's more monsters in it. That's a terrible clip. <laughs> well, 
and we'll try and find another one. Hey, you've been here before, haven't you? You've been uh, over in the UK before. I, I have. I've actually done two movies here and another play. I'm here yeah. doing a play. We're going to get to that in a minute. Good, thank God. Yeah, well, I know that's... <laughs> And now I've met you. Drink tank. Now I've met you. I'm definitely coming to see the play. <laughs> it's good. Um, uh, now the first time you came, did you immediately feel comfortable? Did you like the UK immediately, or well, did you know, it take a while? The first time I came here, actually, I got off a plane and we were doing Hackers with Ian Softley, John Lee Miller, Angelina Jolie. Oh yeah. Long time ago. And uh, I actually, w we were staying in South Kensington, and I walked out of my hotel, and there was a march going on. I don't remember the march. I I've been in two marches in the UK. I was. You in can't the do that in the UK. March. That means something that you see. <laughs> That means like Sorry. that in America, you see, it's the same thing. Why? Why would you do that to me? Because you just did that to me. <laughs> How do you watch it? You did that, but you went like that. That's Why the same as that. Friends? <laughs> Here we are. Read between the lines. All right, let's go. <laughs> no, no, come on, let's be friends. Hands across the water. Kumbaya. Nous sommes la coalition. Oh, uh, anyway. <laughs> You like, but what do you like yeah, about the UK? Two, so I was, was on a, two marches. You were in a march. I've marched for your people. Well, what was the march? I don't remember. Well, you see, <laughs> tell me about you don't want to just get swept up in something. There was, yeah, it was great. Was it the countryside alliance? What was it? Women. You're probably pro hunting now. I like <laughs> kill the foxes. No, you see, don't say that. I was there. I was in the march. You like foxes? I don't care. <laughs> uh, okay. Uh, by the way, these interviews... Don't. In, in America, the interviews go on for two minutes. I got no more stuff. <laughs> <laughs> I got nothing. I got none of those. It's too long! It's not too long. It's too long! It's nice. It's not, we, get to, we get to know you. Relax, take it easy. You're a nice man. You're talking about the poofters. No, they're not called poofters. <laughs> That's probably offensive. I don't know, is it? Is that what it is? What, what, no, just yeah, puff, that's the name of them. Four puffs. Well, yeah, that's right. Yeah. You started it. I didn't start it. You I can't blame me for homosexuality. <laughs> it's not wrong. Uh, what's the play you in then? Called. F no, this yes. is a weird. No, calm down. I have to focus. All right. All right. <laughs> it's a big deal for me. Are we moving now? No, no. Okay. Come on. What's the show called? The it's play called is called Fuddy F U D D Y Mirrors. Fuddy Mirrors. Yeah, it sounds like funny mirrors. But it's funny mirrors. Okay. Funny Crazy. Me. But, but <laughs> what does funny mirrors mean? Don't get into that. I don't <laughs> really know. It's a, 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 a Julia McKenzie, uh -huh. huge British star. She's a tremendous actress. Huge star. Yes, yes. She has a stroke in the in the play, and okay. you can't understand a word she says. And she's trying to say funny mirrors, right. and she says funny mirrors. Funny mirrors. Yes. Uh, it's a crazy. Crazy comedy. We're in Birmingham right now. We're coming down to London at the Arts Theatre. Okay. Great cast. But now, what, oh, now who God, do you, you play? You... Me. I was on a tangent. Yeah. So you you get all the info out. There's you in the play there. And are you, are you called Fuddy Mears? No. That's my puppet, by the way. What, your puppet in the play or just your my own puppet personal puppet? In the, I don't travel with them. And so you have a puppet in the play? I have a puppet in the play. What does the puppet do? Um, his name's Hinky Binky. <laughs> I've got my hand up his ass the whole show. <laughs> and he's very funny. He upstaged me the whole show. And so, and, and is he a, what, a kid's puppet? It's a kind of Yeah, he's show? a, he's a un-PC puppet as you can be. He okay. says everything you want to say in a play, uh, but don't. So what, he's like your alter ego? Yes, exactly. The I'm a simpleton, your if you can imagine that. <laughs> <laughs> and he is the witty uh, banter. It's a great madcap play. It's very funny, and it's short. <laughs> Well, you know, it's short and funny, and Julian McKenzie, and it's on PC, and it's in the Arts Theatre. I got it. I'm good. Well, congratulations. Hey, yes. I, I'm going to come and see it because I've enjoyed your company so much this evening. You have. And the fact that it's a short play is such a major it's, bonus. You will be in the pub by ten o'clock. Perfect. I love a short play. And it's play. funny. You won't have any time to go. Wow, this is a bad play. Will I need to have a, a wee during the play, or do you think I'll be able to hold out? No, it's. An hour first half, you have a couple of drinks, so, whoa, I'm going to be out of here in 45 minutes. Yeah. Uh, how long are you over here for? What are you doing after the play? Uh, f uh, I don't know. Do you have a job? Well, I no, could be a PA. <laughs> I can't sing. And I'm you could join PA. the band if you feel, you know, if you want to. Oh, no doubt we'll see you marching somewhere, I imagine. <laughs> hey, Matthew, really nice to meet you. Thanks, bro. Good success uh, with Funny Meal. I hope he does really well for you. I'm going to come and see you in London. It's the Arts Theatre? Yeah, I'm going to come see you. Okay. Yes. Matthew Lillard, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you. That was great. Thank you. 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 Thank
Thank you very much. Thank you. 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 Thank